Hello and welcome back to the Rex to Riches Dream Home Decorator where Kara is trying to make money by being a Dream Home Decorator. She is doing very well at that. They got a lot of money. They got a cute home. Last episode Lilith and Kara got married and Lilith has turned Kara into a vampire. Uh, it is Lilith's mission to turn at least five sims into vampires she believes it is better to be a vampire than to be a reckless sim because uh, vampires live forever and they are just not bound to mortal life as a surprise for Kira she also turned Marcus Kira's best friend Kira wasn't too happy about this but in the end she forgave Lilith for this so Lilith has transferred two sims into vampires. She needs to do three more. Let's just see if anyone volunteers this episode. I want Kira to up her vampire skill because that will mean she can buy plasma packs. <laughs> I mean, she just learned how to buy plasma packs, which is a very good thing. So she won't have to drink from other sims. Although she isn't really sure yet whether she, uh, she likes plasma packs or she likes uh, drink from sims or maybe even plasma fruits. If they learn how to buy plasma fruits, I will plant them this episode so she can try that out too for herself. And she is leveling up like crazy. It is storming outside, so I'm just uh, keeping them inside for now before they get struck by lightning again. <laughs> yes, I said again. Also, um, when Kira is leveling up in the vampire skill, her vam uh, vampire power will increase. She will become a minor vampire, a master vampire, all the kind of stuff. And eventually she can buy the sunlight resistance trait. And I really want her to have that because every time she goes to a house and she has to uh, invite the the people back in to look at the renovation she is literally burning <laughs> so it would be nice to have that so that's uh, that's what she's working on right now oh yes Kira discovered plasma fruits so i'm gonna mm. order those and plant them in the backyard mm. i bought four plasma fruit packs which equals to eight plasma fruits she is planting them now and hopefully she can harvest them soon and try out if she likes those. Oh yeah, little trick I learned. If you fertilize uh, your plants, they can become higher quality. But if you b uh, just spam fertilize your plants as far as you can, as far as the queue allows, you can just uh, fertilize them with one single plant. Uh, this is a bug in the game, but to speak the wise words of Dr. Gluon, if it's in the game, it's not cheating, right? <laughs> so I'm just having her fertilize six of the trees with the Bird of Paradise, which are the $50 one plants, which will help the most. And I am gonna fertilize the last two with another plant. So, I've fertilized eight trees with uh, just two flowers, which is uh, pretty amazing. And she likes gardening. Now get inside before you get struck by lightning. Lilith has invited Marcus over because part of her aspiration is to train the vampires she created. She has already trained Kira. But now, oh, she can't. Oh, because he's really, really scared. He can be trained right now. Now let's try to console. Let's try to calm him down so she can train him. Kara has gone to bed so she can do her gig tomorrow. But for some reason, Marcus can't be consoled. And he's doing push-ups outside, even though he's terrified of the storm. So I'm just going to give up on that for now. We'll try again next night. Oh, I love the surprise here. This is really Lilith's, Lilith's project. <laughs> she can jump in. I mean, the surprise is sparkly. And as you know, sparkles make everything better. So, <laughs> I love it. Oh, she's staying on a really long time. Can vampires drown? Just uh, asking for friends. Oh, she's okay. <laughs> it's almost time for Kira's gig. Yes, let's get to work. 
Oh, we're at the prairie house again. We've been here before. We decorated the parents' bedroom. Oh, and she is burning to death. <laughs> Quickly knock on the door. She's casually strolling towards the door. I, I think she should be running. Of course, the platform has glitched out again. I'm doing a room renovation here so I can pick which room. I think I'm gonna do the study because it's a bit boring. I'm gonna get to know the clients first. Oh, I've got just colors. They're like pink, black, purple and blue. Oh, the Sim Sessions is here. I am pre-recording this. It's, uh, these sessions are really dating this video. I, of course, I will be reading your comments and replying to them as always, but it can take a few episodes in before I can actually act on those, because this is pre-recorded a few weeks in advance, because I won't have that much time to record when my boys are home from school. I'm just having Kira ask them about their deco preferences and such but it doesn't seem like they have any i don't don't get the option to ask for the de in the decor styles i didn't get anything out of them so i'm just gonna send them away take some full pictures and then we are gonna get to the building part of course i'm speeding this part up again this way we can focus more on kira's story and less on the decorating i am focusing on the colors they gave me so the wall is blue the floor is pink i'm trying to hang some cute curtains in here the windows are really making it difficult for me and the wall height is medium which is also making it difficult i am going for those island living curtains because i just think they're really, really pretty that desk is way too expensive i'm gonna exchange it later on moschino bookcase is really pretty in pink yeah i'm exchanging in the uh, the desk and i wanted a seating area in here so I'm using a black couch because they also like black. I'm using some custom content in here just because I think it's really really pretty. And just putting some decorations in the bookcase, some statues, some plants. And I'm almost all the way through my budget. It, it wasn't much of a budget to begin with. Uh, this car carpet? No, this rug is also custom content with the flowers on it. I think it's really pretty. The whole house has a black and white color scheme. So having a colorful room like this is uh, it's really fun. The parents' bedroom that I renovated is also really, really colorful. I needed something on the wall here and all I could afford were those paw prints. It's a bit sad. I'm gonna take the after photos and let's see what they think of this renovation. Ah, uh, yes, there they are. Come, Kira. Get inside as quick as you can. Let's see if we actually get the size show this time. We get sparkles. That's a good thing. You get before and after pictures. At least Kira is inside. Come on in. Come on in, everyone. Slideshow? No slideshow? Yeah, no slideshow. I'm just gonna edit that one in. Here got the before. Very boring. And after, so colorful. So beautiful and boring. Oh, so beautiful. <laughs> I'm sorry, I watched too much of James Turner's videos. <laughs> I didn't want to subject you to this. Uh, let's just see what the client thinks of this. Oh, they're all ready for the final verdict. Come on, this is the sun, I believe. See, and he loves it. Yes, he loves it. Last time when I did the parents' bathroom, the children loved it and the parents hated it. <laughs> but I still got paid. Luna, no, thank you. And what do you think? This is the daughter, I believe. No, she doesn't like it. Ooh. Okay, one out of six likes it. The other daughter, I love her, Tiara. <laughs> Like no, she doesn't like it either. Oh my. One out of three is liking it. The little boy. Do you like it? 
No, he also doesn't like it. Oh, this one is a very bad one. Okay, we still got two to go. Where are they? Oh, there is the dad. Let's see if he likes it. To be fair, they did, didn't give him much to go on. Just colors. Oh, he doesn't like it either. Oh, no, 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 no. Chances are I won't be getting paid for this. Just one to go. Is this the daughter or the mom? I think the daughter. Oh, they got the mom. Do you like it? Yes, yeah, she, li she liked it. Okay, two out of six liked it. What does this mean for money and reputation? She does like it a lot though. I just get money and reputation. I don't get this game. Well, I'll take it. Okay, let's get another gig for tomorrow before I forget. I want something different than a room innovation. This was a bit... I mean, it's getting a bit old. I I know I said I like those, but I don't know, maybe a room addition? They are really bugged, but it, it might be fun. I can use cheats to get around it, I've, I've done so before. Maybe an arcade addition, this is for a commercial lot. So double the chances to be bugged. Gera can't go out in the sunlight, so I'm just having her read about vampires some more, just to level up her skill. And I'm having Lilith train Kira in being a vampire, so that her vampire skill is going up. Yeah, see the purple bat above her ha head means that she is uh, ranking up. And they got a sentiment, that's nice. Oh, who's there? It's a uh, teenage girl and there of course there's only one reason she would knock on the door of the home of two vampires. That's because she really wants to be a vampire herself. Isn't it? I mean there's no other reason. Just uh, Kira is talking to her, trying to get to know her and she she really doesn't want her to be a vampire. She thinks Lilith has created two vampires now. It should be enough. So she's trying to scare her away. But apparently, no, it doesn't work. She even liked it that she pretended to bite her. Kira is still trying to talk her out of it. <laughs> Lilith just took a peek. I think... Uh, she would want to introduce herself. Gera and Lilith just sitting there. Lilith like, oh it would be amazing for you to be a vampire. All your problems will disappear. You won't have, uh, have to eat. You can uh, just drink plasma. You'll gain super speed. You can fly as a bat. And you'll never ever die. And Gera is like, but sunlight. And yummy foods. And I, I really, really sure that this is this is what you want to do. Looks like the girl Mickey has made up her mind. She really wants to become a vampire, and Lilith is just too happy to comply. Yes, and her third offspring. <laughs> now she's gonna drink from Lilith. I don't know what this girl has been to that she wants to be a vampire so desperately. Maybe she just watched too many uh, Twilight movies. And now she's joking around. Okay. Well. Lilith is gonna try to console her. Oh, here's Marcus! He's back for some prepared training and he's feeling playful. Um, I'm gonna have Lilith introduce him to his new sibling, Mickey. And I'm just realizing that also means that Kira is one of Lilith's children and her wife. It's, it's a bit, bit complicated. <laughs> Oh, oh, they seem to like each other. Oh, this is nice. She is great, yes. 
Yeah, nice. Okay, Lilith is gonna Who's offer Marcus some training because she really Who's needs to train Marcus? three of her ah. offsprings. And we need to wait until Who's Mickey turns <laughs> actually into a vampire that takes about oh. two, three days. And then she can uh, she can train Smith her too. Lane. Meanwhile, Kara has just decided to uh, go swim laps. I think it's time for Powerhouse to get her around again. Let's uh, go to the gym together. Kara and Lilith both love Pablo fitness. Pablo I mean, it's actually one of their likes. Kara is showing off to the Shut gym trainer. And she is getting uh, mentored right now, so her skill will go up even faster, which is already going up really fast because she's a vampire. I don't know how this works, but vampires just uh, learn more quickly. Kara is getting kind of hungry, so she asks if she could drink from her trainer, but she really doesn't want to. I mean, Kira still hasn't really figured out if she wants to drink from plasma packs or from Sims. She's now asking Paolo. What he wants? No, he does not want her to drink from him. Let's ask the next person. <laughs> By now she has asked everyone in Powerhouse, but no one wants her to drink from them. I'm just gonna take them home so uh, she can get ready for her gig tomorrow. Kara is feeling really tense, suffocated by friendship. She's getting too many friends. Um, what? Okay, and she's feeling a bit feverish. I'm gonna get some medicine for her. Lilith is playing with the sprites again. I really love how shiny they are. <laughs> it really is Lilith's project. And of course, she jumped into the pool again. She really loves her fitness. And it's time to go to work okay we are in windenburg <laughs> and they wanted an arcade edition so Sister. i'm guessing i need to add something to this That's structure this person that? is from strangerville oh, she is obviously really military really with uh, apparently she Nobody. also owns this we pub or at least represents it <laughs> I'm gonna get her likes and dislikes and see what we're working with. Okay, she likes suburban contemporary, gothic farmhouse, painting and rocket science. You are aware we're doing an arcade, right? <laughs> okay, at least I've got two decor styles. I'm gonna chat with her a little bit more, see if I get some more likes and dislikes. She didn't give me any more likes and dislikes, so I'm just gonna take some before pictures. I'm guessing I'm just gonna place it on, on the back here. I have no idea how many tiles I'm gonna get. Okay, let's get into build mode. No new tiles allowed. I mean, this is an addition, right? Um, I can't add anything, so I'm just gonna change the interior. And it <laughs> really leaves me a choice. I am filtering by the styles we had, but it is an arcade, so I'm replacing an arcade machine, of course. I don't think it will be okay otherwise. Oh, it might be. It seems it's weird in that way. Um, I'm trying to make everything fit with the current decor style, so that it won't uh, stand out as, as much. I think uh, if I'm using uh, those brown things, it's... Uh, it will be okay. I'm using some custom content. I'm trying to play a rocket ship. Yeah, it fits uh, right there in the back because what pub doesn't have a rocket ship? And I did have a place for a second arcade machine. And she did like painting, so she gets an easel and she did get uh, some paintings. I only got 2000 Simonians left, but I can spend it on some more decorations. Okay, time for move objects just to fill the place up with as much plants as I can and I'm going over budget. Uh, <laughs> I'm trying to stick as close to the budget as I can. Oh, nice ship. Ah. Yes, I think this is it. It's a, it is an arcade edition. I mean, I turned most of the pub into an arcade, but isn't that what they wanted? Just gonna take some after pictures and then, uh, let's see what she thinks. I called her back to the lot. We've got the sparkles. Do we get the slideshow? 
Um, no, no slideshow. Okay, I'm just gonna edit one in then. Where I thought arcade was gonna be versus where it is now. <laughs> and a picture of the outside. And we've got a beautiful arcade on the inside. Some more grass. And just a gorgeous, gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just having fun with the editing of the pictures. As you might have been able to tell, I'm just gonna show off everything and I hope she's gonna like it. She looks really happy so far. Is she ready to give a verdict? Check this out. Yes, yes, she loves it, she loves it. Yes, I think this is gonna be a positive verdict. Oh, yes. Do you like it? I, I love it. I love what you've done to the place. I know I said I wanted an addition, but uh, I didn't give you any tiles to work with. So this is just perfect. I, I actually am gonna stay here on the lot. And ask my friends to come hang out to play with their arcade. But I'm gonna select new gig before I forget. There are a lot of new gigs to choose from. I think I'm gonna try a basement gym level edition. Now I'm really hoping the game is gonna let me do this. But otherwise we always got cheats. Of course. There I just invited powerhouse over to play on the arcade. There is no bartender or anything, so the lot isn't a bar yet. Or rest. Ooh, pa uh, Paolo hates the plant. He actually stopped playing the arcade just to tell me. <laughs> Kara has taken Lilla to the side because she would really want to adopt a child. I think it would be absolutely adorable, but Lilith is still working with her vampire ch children, so she doesn't want to yet. So she's actually suggesting that Kira would adopt a cat first, just to see how she likes it to care, take care of other living creatures. Kira and Marcus are now both the ch children of Lilith. And Kira has asked Marcus to join her in a duel, just to see who would win. It's just a friendly vampire duel. It looks really cool though. <laughs> who do you think uh, would win? Place your bets in the comments right now. There you go, there you go. Oh, Kira lost! Marcus won, despite his fashion sense. I should should change him into gas. I, I will at some point, but I do think it's really, really funny. <laughs> it looks like that when he turns into a vampire. I sent the girls home. Since the plasma trees all haven't grown yet, I've just bought a lot of pa plasma packs for Kira. She needs to drink a lot of them to uh, <laughs> cleanse her thirst. Hey Mickey, nice of you to come hang out. She is feeling really uncomfortable from turning into a vampire. She isn't a vampire yet because they can still drink from her. But Lilith can give her a pep talk and just uh, try to make her feel a bit more comfortable. Lilith really cares about her vampire children. Kara is now going to adopt a kitten. Because Lilith uh, suggested this and she thinks that if maybe if Lilith likes taking care of the cat as well then maybe she will be more open to adopting a child. I really like this one. It looks a bit like a tiger. It's so cute. Okay, where is the kid? Oh, there he is. It's a little boy. Oh, he is so cute. Let's go meet him. Kara is trying a cautious introduction. Oh, if the kitten wouldn't have it, maybe after friendship. Maybe the kitten's noticing that they are vampires and doesn't really like it. Oh no, she. Oh, she likes this. She likes. Oh, he likes this. It's, it's a boy kitten. What a cutie. Lilith is introducing herself to the kitten as well. <laughs> he doesn't really like her either. 
Let's try to chase. Oh, he let her pet him. That is cute. I'm gonna have Kira adopt this kitten. Yes. I do want to. I do not like the name Yui or whatever it's pronounced. I think he like l looks like a tiger. So I think I'm gonna call him Tiger. I want to buy some stuff for the cat but we don't really have the room. I mean when they have a child we can't hold on to the tiny house anymore I'm guessing. I'm gonna get one of those automatic feeders because I always forget to feed pets. I um, you know it's bad, but I, I don't really. They are vampires, right? They do not need their kitchen. <laughs> they do not need to eat. So I'm just gonna delete the kitchen and make it into a pet area. So I've given the kitten everything he needs a scratch ball, a uh, litter tray that uh, has laser eyes. A food station and a place to sleep. I made everything in yellow because I think it fits him. I'm having Kira talk and play with the kitten. <laughs> oh, it is so adorable. Yeah. I have Kira reading more about vampires. That way she can level up. I really want her to get the sunlight resistance trait. But she is not there yet. <laughs> Kara and Lilith are having breakfast together. <laughs> really nice. And I'm gonna have Lilith give Kira some more vampiric training. And now it's almost time for her to get to work. But maybe they can get some training in still. So, and if you do this, you're gonna float. Oh, yes, yes. Oh, time to go to work. Sorry, Lilith. Looks like we are in Oasis Springs. The sunniest world next to Solani. Oh, and maybe Strangerville. But <laughs> it's one of the more sunny worlds. So let's get Kira inside as quickly as possible. We've got a very pregnant sim over here. They want a basement gym level addition. So I guess I'm gonna have to build a basement and put a gym in there. She is really really pregnant. She's also an elder. So probably she can give birth at any moment. There's also a child walking around. Oh! What is happening? Mickey! Mickey is... She's turning into a vampire! In the sunniest world in The Sims. Mickey, please go home before you burn to death. Little will be very, very sad if you burn to death. Just go home. Don't... Oh, she... She has already going home queued up. She should be alright. I think. Maybe. Can I cheat her? Make him leave, please. Go home. Okay, I'm hoping Mickey is gonna get home alright. For now, I've got that they dislike singing and do like Peggio decor. I mean, you guys, you know I'm gonna do a gym. Oh, they do like fitness. Well, that is useful in a gym and they dislike cooking. Uh, one of the sims, the one that is sitting in the chair right now, is Chidi Anaconye. I, uh, at one point I was really obsessed with the show, with that show, uh, the good place, yes it's called good place, and I downloaded him from the gallery. <laughs> it's really funny that he's just spawned here and just living here, because I didn't put him in the safe house. They dislike modern decor, well... I mean, what do you like? I'm just gonna talk to him a little bit more. Maybe I do get a decor style. Okay, can I get a different decor style? Dislikes French country decor. I mean, I want likes, not dislikes people. Come on. Okay, chat and with them some more. They dislike white. Dislike contemporary decor. They like color pink and dislike the color purple and they also told me again they do like patio decor so uh, i think i'm gonna make the entrance in the hallway here just a uh, new stairs next to this one so i'm gonna just take some before pictures in here of a brown wall so yeah this one gave me some trouble again i am trying to create a basement but it wouldn't let me it doesn't let me on any way 
I'm trying. I'm trying pre-made rooms, I'm trying just to create rooms on all the different levels, but it doesn't let me place a room anywhere. So I'm gonna use some cheats. We have got the enable free build on now and of course move objects. So now I'm gonna actually can actually place a stairs so we can enter the basement and I've created the actual basement. I'm trying to find some uh, fences and I am trying to keep to the budget even though the budget isn't counting right now. At least at the beginning I am. I'm gonna let go of the budget in the end. <laughs> Just because I wanted to make it look fancy. It is a gym, so I'm placing some gym equipment here. I am uh, looking at what counts for the decor styles they like. There is a TV in there for when you're walking the treadmill. And some mirrors so you can check your form while doing boxing. All that uh, other thing, uh, the combat uh, simulator. And placing some posters on the wall. I didn't want it to make too uh, too fancy. And I wanted something of a rug down here. And this is the gym. I really hope they are gonna like it. Let me know if you like this gym addition in the comments. So I'm gonna call the clients back to the lot. And then Kira needs to go inside. Okay, two of them. Three of them never left. But... Oh, how did she come from the basement? How? Oh, and yet Kira reached photography level 5, which is the highest one. See, do they actually go to the basement? Do we get a slideshow? Oh, they're covering their eyes. That's a good sign. And they, yes, they are actually walking towards the basement. Amazing. Oh, and we get a slideshow! And there was nothing there, and now there is a gym! And nothing there! And now we've got gym equipment with a nice mirror! And nothing! And this is better than nothing! <laughs> oh, I'm having fun with this slideshow! <laughs> I really like the, the they put this feature in here. Okay, now I'm just gonna show off some objects and a chat to them let's check out this rug it's exactly in the style you liked she is looking at the tiny saucer of course and they all seemed really really happy with, with it oh and all of them are ready to talk <laughs> Kara is still joking with the child Kara really wants children I hope Lilith will Till two one day. Oh, she loves it. She loves it. One out of six. And it is a really good hand handshake. Okay, Chitty. Chitty, come on. Oh, you're too busy jumping in front of the mirror. Um, come on, talk to me. Yes, he loves it. He loves it. Okay, next one. The handshake is a bit out of sync. Child seems to really love it too. Yes, he also loves it. All three of them love it. Okay, next one, next one. Come on, do you love it too? Please? Do you love it? Yes, also, four out of six. I didn't have a lot of to go on, but uh, I'm glad they still liked what I did. Okay, ask the child, and I'm still w missing one person. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. I'm missing one person. Okay, the child likes it too. Oh, yes. Oh, she is ready to. Do you like it? Yes, she loves it too. All oh, six of them love it. I haven't had this much success in a while. I got money, I got reputation. Okay, I'm gonna stay on the lot and of course I am gonna pick another gig and then invite over my friends to enjoy the gym because we are a gym club and they're really gonna like it. What are we gonna do? This will be the first one for the next episode. I like the in-law unit addition. Probably gonna be bugged out again, but we do have cheats. 
Okay, I'm gonna leave this part here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please press like as it really helps out me and my channel. I'll post a new episode of this Rex to Riches challenge next week. Next Saturday will be the next episode of the 100 baby challenge. Please leave your comments and suggestions in the comments. I am pre-recording this so it could take a few episodes because before I can act on your comments. But of course I will read them all, I will reply to them all because I just love interacting with you guys so i hope to see you next time bye bye